Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Monticello, Florida with J-Town Press, which is really not that far away from Tallahassee, but J-Town Press is not there to admire the scenery of the local area. J-Town is there to, well, fraud at the local public defender's office. However, Lana ends up getting trespassed. Oh boy, oh boy, the moron gets trespassed from another establishment. Oh boy, how many does this make for you in your lifetime, Lana? I don't know, I've lost count. So at any rate, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Welcome back to the J-Town Press. This is in Jefferson County, Florida, here in Monticello. This is an entire government complex. The public defender's office at the very end is where it really got crazy. Oh, Lana, you should have uh, emailed me and let me know that you were going to be in my neck of the woods. I mean, I could easily have uh, taken it down to see the sights and... Tallahassee at the very least, maybe the Tallahassee Junior Museum, or go down further south to Wakulla County and right into the city of St. Mark's and, well, let you enjoy the local wildlife. I'm sure they would really love you down there. Not. She said to come see you for a, a public records request. Okay. Are you filming me? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Are you filming me? Absolutely. Why is that? Because it's lawful. It's the First Amendment. It's called freedom of press. I just need to do a, a public records request. If you want to put on the press, turn your camera off. I'm not going to. Okay, then I'll be right here until you do. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. So Are you refusing you? service? You have no so, right to record me. Anyway, I so I would like to do a, uh, a public records request under Florida On Statute 119. On what? A flo uh, it's called a public records request. And what are you requesting? I'm requesting the video that your tax collector just gave to me. Oh, I don't have no... I well, I'm, I'm putting it to you. Contact. Yeah, it's an oral request. Contact the tax collector. I yeah. have no access to that information. Okay, can I speak to her, please? Okay, Lana, I will see your statute 119 and raise you statute 810, which is the Florida trespassing law. And, uh, well, they're going to ask you to leave because of your behavior in this place. So this is all on you at this point, which really makes me wonder if... Uh, you knew about that statute earlier. That shows you know how to look up statutes. Did you ever bother to look up the trespassing statute and see, well, maybe you want to behave yourself in a place like this? Because, you know, that can happen. You can be trespassed out of a government building if you cause trouble. But I know you don't care. You don't care about the facts. I know you don't care about uh, the fact that the Earth is a... Uh, uh, spheroid, not flat. I mean, yeah, I know you are a flat earther, too. You've made your opinion quite clear on that on a couple of occasions. Go to the door, knock on the door, and she'll let you back. Okay. I'm going over there now. Is she there? Is she there available? Can I talk to her? I just want to see if you can go get the tax collector for me so I can talk to her. I've been waiting for her. Yeah, if you don't mind. I've been waiting out here for a while. Oh. Thanks. It's going to be just a minute. She has someone in her office right now. All right. Thank you All so right, much. Thank you. I just want to see if I can just do, instead of waiting and, and, and wasting time, can I just do a, uh, can I just do a pu public records request yeah. to make this easier? That way I can get out of here and I'm not wasting people's time. But that's all you ever do is waste people's time, especially government employee time, which you tend to complain about uh, how the government wastes money on a lot of things, but yet you, uh, make the situation even worse by uh, taking their time away from their job, thus wasting more government tax dollars on nonsense, something that you are against. I mean, it's quite the little paradox right there, isn't it? 
would you, can I request you give me that in writing so that there's no mistake about what you are expecting from her? Yeah, this is the video she just took. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's that simple. It be just a quick statement. Fine. Yeah. And you're Miss uh, Lisa uh, Burton? Burton. Burton. Yeah. Yep. Nice. All right, thank you so much. Okay, thank Have you. a good day. Thanks. Well, a lot of all the records request, but uh, this isn't over yet. There's still much more to come. Lana still isn't done antagonizing these uh, public employees. So if you apply here for since food stamps, Medicaid, temporary cash. No, ma'am, you're not. Um, I'm going to need you to leave. Oh, is this open to the public? It, you're going to need to speak with Michael McNamara at the telehousing office. For what? That's all the press requests go through him. Oh, yeah, I'm not requesting anything. Well, then you need to leave. Oh, no, I'm, this is open to the public, is it not? Uh, if you're I'm just asking. Client, then you need to leave. What's that? If you're not a client, then you need to leave. What, who do you work for, ma'am? The press. Which press? Free press. Which which one is that? Is that yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, who are you? Is it the Associated Press? Is, uh, are, I'm, I'm sorry, who are you? I'm Catherine Turner. I'm the Chief Assistant Public Defender. Oh, okay, cool. I'm asking you to leave my office. Oh, okay. Is this, is this open to the public? It is not, actually. So oh, it's not. Then why is there, why is there, are you taxed by, or be, um, funded by public tax dollars? You need to go. For what? Do you have a red number? Yeah. Yeah, this is open to the public. This is a public office. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah. Laugh all you want. Laugh at this statute right here. Uh, laugh at the fact that you're about to be escorted out of the building, trespassed, and all that other stuff. So, congratulations, Lana. You are a freaking, uh, well, moron. So, yeah, go ahead and laugh at the fact that you're a moron. <laughs> wow. Amazing. <laughs> now, when I filled out the job application, they did not put this on. They didn't no. put this on here. No. They did not put this on here. Because I didn't. But that's a cute little fake mustache. Oh, yeah. I, I appreciate it. Is that with Sharpie or what? Crayola. <laughs> I mean, C Crayola. Yeah. <laughs> Crayola. <laughs> What records requesting are you requesting by the way? I want your personnel file and I want your last pay stub. <laughs> are you not a public employee? We're talking to you, sweetheart. Okay. This honey, honey. Am I supposed to be intimidated by your dollars? Am I supposed to be intimidated by your laughter? <laughs> I'm screaming! I'm screaming. Is this how you treat all the members of the public? Whatever your name is, because you're not you're, you're not gonna take up my time, my assistance. You're here. I was literally making a, a, a round of a foot, yeah. How you doing, sir? Good, how are you? And what's your name? Hey, we don't, we don't know is your body camera? I was just, just a minute, man. Sure. Wow, you gotta love those ladies. They burn Lana to a crisp and but unfortunately Lana is just too damn stupid to figure it out. A little longer than a few minutes later. How you doing, man? Good. What's your name, sir? Uh, my name is Sergeant James Stutt. Stutt. Do you have a bad ID number? Uh, 0366. Hey, is your body camera acting by chance? Uh, yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so what, what seems to be the problem today? I literally came in to say anything to anybody, mm -hmm. and I was actually over here looking at their public information, okay. and that's when they kind of flipped out on me. <laughs> okay, and awesome. And then I asked them if I could get a... Uh, public records of class so and then she kind of just they were I guess they were cackling so loud I could we really couldn't have a conversation okay so. and your name um am I legally required to provide it yes ma'am I, I was called here on a legal reason if you could give me your name that'd be and what, expi get, expedite this well I, I'm not going to I'm gonna keep you're my going fourth amendment unless you're unless you're you know unless okay. I'm required to by law what's your reasonable article of suspicion that I've committed a so I know who I'm talking to oh, my name's me. Lana Lana yeah that's all I'll give you for right now unless I'm you know legally required okay to, so all right well this is the deal Lana okay they don't want you here. Okay, this is a public she, lobby. She has advised you that public records requests are held. But that's not what our entertainment one nineteen says. I can actually just give well, it to them. Man, that, that's fine. If you want so to take that up with right, through them know. through the legal right. process, that's fine. Come on now, uh, Lana. Can you override your narcissism uh, program and actually let the officer talk? I mean, I know you think you're the smartest person on the planet, but usually people who think they're the smartest people on the planet are quite ignorant of everything. I was actually looking but at they the are asking you to leave, okay? Okay. So if I don't like public records requests are handled through okay. 301. I was literally looking at okay. South, yeah. South County Road, Leon County Courthouse. Yeah, I've got a car. Okay. So. 
So is there any other business you're conducting here? I was literally looking at, I was move, making my way around the room. Okay, <laughs> well we've made our way around it. the room, so you can go ahead and exit now. If I don't, what's gonna happen? What do you want to happen? I want to finish my business is all I want to do. I was literally didn't say anything to you, anybody. You have no more business here. I said here. nothing to her and I said nothing to her. Okay, but there's no more business to conduct there, here. There is, it's called Freedom of Press, sir. Are okay. you closing the office? We're closing, yeah, we do close it for her. She's got to go to the hospital, so. Okay, okay. yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Yeah. I've, got, I've got six minutes. Okay. okay. Yeah. Did, did you want her trespass? Yeah, I did. Did yeah. you give her she, a trespass? She won't give no, not yet. So. Okay, well go ahead. And, and, what's your name, ma'am? Go ahead and get a trespass. Okay, ma'am, your ID, you're being trespassed. Pass as my legal reason to yeah. get your well, ID. Actually, the, I need your ID. Can I explain it to you? Man. No, you cannot. Oh, she's going to try to explain her side of the story, but it's full of inaccuracies, stupidity, uh, her own uh, misguided beliefs and everything like that. You know, the usual bullshit. So basically what happens is, is if I stay, that's when the crime happens, not you no, asking. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma We're going to give really. you a trespass yeah, warning is. now, okay? okay. I'm going to go then, get a trespass so warning. So okay. He's going to issue a warning. Can I ask you a question? If I don't leave, what's going to happen? You're going to get trespass from here today, okay? okay? And then once you leave, you're not welcome to come back, and okay? And what Huh? What happens if I do? If you do come back, you will go to jail. Okay. Then I'm going to go to arrest. And just for the record, I, I did advise her who the public records attorney is over in Tallahassee. So, okay. Uh, um, she's, she's got that contact information if that's who she's okay. looking for, but just, she doesn't need to be here at clients. And what's your name, ma'am? Can I get Detective. your name, please? Detective what? Yep, yeah, that's You're going to be good. professional or? Well, you're not being very nice. I, I am. You're not. You're I'm not asking you. You step right out here to my truck, policy? please, Miss Lana. Am I being detained? Yes, you're being issued a trespass warning. Am I being detained? Yes, you are. For what legal reason? To issue a trespass warning. So if I don't follow you over there, what's going to happen? You know, Lana, you should go right over to Leon County Courthouse and do the exact same thing over there. And but you'll find out just as quickly as Ass Elmo did that they will trespass you and kick you out. Just like that. Just like they did here. And you know what? When Ass Elmo came to town, I was just down the road from him when he was there. Only problem is, I was at work. If I had known he was there, I would have stopped by the courthouse and, well, give him a nice cam back and pissed him off even more. Think about it real close, sir. You think this Ms. is Lana? Yeah, you're, you're well, well, actually getting yourself into a federal lawsuit right now because okay. you have all you did was you told me to leave. Mm -hmm. I've left, and the, you, cri the crime does not happen until I go Ms. back Lana, in there. Ms. Lana, you're going to be issued a trespass warning. Okay, then for issue this me a location. trespass. That's why I'm asking you to step over to my vehicle. But you've just detained me for what legal reasons, sir? What was your probable Ms. Lana, cause, sir? Okay, the sergeant is going to go you. ahead and bring the trespass over here, so we oh, don't sure. have to walk there. If that's going so to make I'm being you more happy. Yes, ma'am. You for, need to be for what? to issue the trespass warning. But what's the crime? What's the statute that I broke? They're requesting a trespass warning be issued. So Ms. what's Lana. the crime, sir? What's the crime? The crime hasn't been committed yet. Ms. Exactly. Exactly. You are being issued exactly. the trespass warning. So, so you're that telling me that I've not return. committed a crime and you've just illegally detained me. Yes, ma'am. Absolutely. Well, there you go. I appreciate you admitting it on camera. Okay. So spell my name right, please. Oh, I definitely will. Okay. Thank you. You'll be the first one listed. Okay. That's yeah, you show your footage to the judge, and I'm sure you'll get laughed right out of court because you don't have a legal leg to stand on. They asked you to leave several times, which is shown on the camera, and you got legally trespassed. It's as simple as that. So your threats toward the officer are not exactly holding water at this point. I have your ID? I do not. Ma'am, you need to produce your ID. I don't ID. have an ID. If I don't give you an ID, what's going to happen? What do you want to happen? I'm asking you. I mean, you're, you're the one that's making it. What are you doing up here today? Honestly, what are you? I told you. What, I'm, what are you doing? I told you that I'm pressed. For who? Well, I'm gonna. I'm gonna, not going to answer any more questions. I'm going to invoke my Fifth Amendment. <laughs> Your birthday. Um, and what's going to happen if I don't give it to you, sir? It's called obstruction. Do you know that statute? Well, you might want to think about that one. Do you know mm -hmm. that statute? The crime has not happened until I go back. Can you take your sunglasses off so I can see your eyes, please? Is that a lawful command? I'm asking. He oh, said well, please. I'm not going to. If you said I said please. please. That okay, doesn't well, make I'm it a lawful. I'm not going to, no. Okay, so you're just going to be completely... What's your last name, Lana? Uh, I'm not going to give it unless I'm under threat of arrest. Go ahead and write Lana on there. We got her picture. Okay. If she comes back, she's st we're tell telling you now you're trespassing. I understand that. Okay? And if I go back in there, I'll be arrested. You Is yes, that sir. what you said? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Hey, Lana, how is this protecting our rights? I mean, if anything, uh, you're going to be contri contributing to the uh, 
degradation of everybody's overall rights when legislators start making laws to curtail activities of these First Amendment auditors. I mean, you guys are going to be the ones to blame should that kind of legislation pass. Can you tell me about how old you are? Not unless I'm uh, not unless I'm required to by law. Ask me a question. Yeah. I'm not going to answer any more questions. I've already invoked my Fifth Amendment right. Okay, but you keep talking. That's detain me. Detain me. Well, that's that's called freedom of speech. So I'm allowed to to say what I want. And you're a sergeant. Yes, ma'am. And I'll put my ID number on there just as you ask for. Can you give her, or is she going to be professional and give it to me, or? doesn't matter how I am. You're, you're still supposed to have a level of professionalism. We, we have not uh, done anything. Here's your copy. You can leave the property can I, now. Can I, ma'am, leave the property. Can I have your badge number? Do you have a card, anything? My name so is Detective I, Ren Johnson. Okay, and what's you're your badge number, please? To leave okay, the property, can I have your okay? badge number, and I'm walking About away. two more minutes, and you're going to have it. You need to leave the property now. Okay. So the whole property have a good direct day. order. I'm giving you a direct at, order I'm to leave leaving. the property now. So mm -hmm. the where, now where is the boundaries at? So I know. That what the hell is the matter with you? Just get off the property, get as far away from here as you can, and go file your fictional lawsuit and try to act like a normal human being that doesn't try to stomp on anybody else's rights while you're at it too. I mean, come on now. It comes right down to it. You have become the very thing that you think you're fighting. In other words, you have become part of the problem and not the solution. You are nothing more than a, uh, well, bully at this point. But unfortunately, you are just too damn stupid to figure that out. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?